A few months ago, Nicole Norwood would have been unrecognizable. After struggling with drugs for many years, the 30-year-old mother was taken to a rehab facility in Piru and now says she's doing better. I feel a lot better than a month ago, that's for sure. Um, a little bit more optimistic and happy. <laughs> Although her physical appearance has drastically changed, the struggle with cravings is still there. There's sometimes when I get cravings, it hasn't been nearly as significant as the first time at all. Thank God. But um, yeah, of course, like, I mean, sitting in groups, you know, and like when people like start talking about like, oh, I used to do this, I used to do that. Of course, like in my head, I'm like, oh man, like I did that. And, like I did that. Oh, like it like it gets in my head and I'll like start to have that euphoric recall. But luckily, as soon as I start getting that euphoric recall, I'm like, oh, wait a minute. It's followed by like peer torture. People that go through rehabs and spend 30 days or 60 days or 90 days or even a year, if they go and they leave and they just jump, jump right back into what they used to do, yes. their success rate goes down to almost nothing. Norwood says she's ready to reunite with her five-year-old son after being away from each other because of addiction. In order to get my kid back, I need to have um, my own place with like a room for him, his own place. So I yes. need to like start working and saving up and getting out of debt. So like. Right you know, start working towards that end goal. That's the only thing that means anything to me, is that kid. In Piru, reporting for The Signal, I'm Lorena Mejia.